Today we're witnessing the end of an era. Um, this magnet was the first three Tesla magnet in the world and it was delivered to this center in 1991. It's been running continuously for almost uh, 20 years and it was the center of our research for much of that time. It's now going to CERN where it's going to be used by scientists at York to investigate the effects of magnetic fields on the radioactive decay of short-lived particles uh, generated by the accelerator there. So today it will be lifted out of this purpose-built construction by the large crane that's behind us and taken to Daresbury for refurbishment before eventually being shipped to CERN in 1991. We were all gathered here on this same spot as the magnet was lowered into place. I'm feeling today a bit like 21 years ago, really. Just quite excited watching these things being done. I remember them craning over onto the little pad out there and then they put it on skates and drew it in. It took quite a few men to get it in because it's quite a weight. Once it was all in, we inspected it to make sure everything was still as it should be. And in that moment, I was captured looking uh, intelligent for once. This magnet is a three Tesla system. It was the first of its kind. The Tesla is a measurement of magnetic field strength. The Earth's field is about one sixty thousandth of the field of this magnet. So it is 60,000 times stronger than the Earth's magnetic field. It is probably 40 or 50 times stronger than the strongest bar magnet that you may encounter in normal life. So an extremely powerful magnet. This magnet played a pivotal role in the early days because it was one of the first machines that the medics could use and it was groundbreaking really. Actually three Tesla has become the research norm. So in most of the leading research institutions around the world, a three Tesla magnet of this sort is what you will find. And increasingly, such systems are also appearing in the hospital environment. It's nice to be in on these things at the development stage and then watch them grow as they're taken on commercially. See how many ideas that uh, we came up with actually managed to get onto the commercial machines. An MRI system was developed around it by scientists here as the fastest MRI system in the world and it really held that record for most of that uh, two decades in which it was operational. The magnet technology has changed quite a great deal because it's now a case where all the systems are in the machine really. It's a simpler machine in the old days but now of course as progress goes on they get a little easier to operate but they're more complex when they go wrong, which is unfortunately the way of the world, isn't it? When the building was constructed, there was an end panel which was removable. So, of course, that was put into place after the magnet was delivered and it was always designed so that the magnet could be removed when finally it was to be retired. The magnet has been here for the uh, duration of the life of this building, so it's always been with us. It will be strange coming into this room and finding there isn't this three Tesla magnet here. I'm a bit sad to be honest to see it go because it's, it is literally the end of an era. Um, but that's progress, isn't it? 